We rolling. We got the Star Wars jammies on. Because we do. What do we have in the background today, boys? Ladies and gentlemen, we have little baby Yoda here. And we also have the Daily Bugle that I'm about to stream. But anyways, guys, welcome back to another Sith Geek YouTube video on the channel today. How are you guys all doing? I'm doing perfectly. Now, this is a couple days after that I've been to the Lego store and I got a massive amount of Lego. Not gonna lie, I probably spent the most amount of money I've ever spent on Lego in one single set. So yeah, it's been a couple days since the Lego store and I thought I would make a little haul for you guys if you were interested to see what I picked up. Now, big Lego Star Wars fan. Might give that away. <laughs> Might give away what I actually bought. But we're going to kick off today with a couple of sets that I actually had previously that I've not shown on the YouTube channel. And yeah, without further ado, let's go straight in. So, the first set, guys, that wasn't part of the haul of recent of August 1st is this one. Is the Everything is Awesome set. It's the it's got the uh, monochrome uh, Lego minifigures: black, brown, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, baby blue, white, pink. And I can't wait to make this set. I'm gonna do so much in terms of um really cool Instagram stuff and everything. So I'm gonna get my you know Instagram off the ground, my Sith Geek photos Instagram off the ground again with this set. It'll be so cool to make photos and that, so that's awesome. I'll leave a link in the description down below if you wanna go check that Instagram out. The next one, which wasn't really part of this um, massive haul. Sorry about the camera, it's just all focusing in and out. I need to get a new lens for my camera that doesn't actually, um, when it focuses in and out, it doesn't actually make a sound. But is this one here, so I bought this I bought this back when um, the Black Widow was shown on Disney Plus for exclusive access and I was like, oh, I'll build the, this Lego set and it unfortunately was delayed um, getting here so it took its time getting here so I didn't actually build it um, for when it was uh, coming out so that's, that's annoying. It's the 76162 uh, Black Widow set here, the Black Widow's helicopter chase, we get Black Widow, uh, ta Taskmaster and that. I think these boxes are really cool really underrated and I wouldn't mind another wave of Black Widow sets so if you want to if you want me to do a potential wave 2 of Black Widow sets even though it's never gonna happen I could do that anyways guys we've come to the time where this is part of the actual August 1st sets now there's a couple sets that I've made so far that I'm about to do reviews on for the YouTube channel and these are these two smallest Star Wars sets so let's kick it off with this one here and this is set number 75310, Jewel on Mandalore. Awesome little set here. And uh, it's quite underrated. Uh, I, I do quite like it. Exclusive uh, mall minifigure here. So it's so cool. So set number 75310. Oh, my controllers just fell off my desk. <laughs> um, and it's it's an awesome little set there. I also have built the this one here. 75311 Imperial Armored Marauder. <laughs> I always say it wrong. Marauder. Marauder. <laughs> Look, guys, that's how, you, that's how you say it. I always, <laughs> I always say it wrong. But this is an awesome we set as well. Um, it's got the artillery uh, stormtrooper, which is quite sought after. I can quickly show you guys the actual sets here just for a little sneak peek before the. Um, before the reviews, so that's the Marauder, <laughs> Marauder, um, minifigure one, minifigure two, and then this is for the ah ah Ahsoka Battle of Mandalore, three, and then, hey! Camera's just going in and out, and then obviously the throne room as well. So, the rest of these sets I've actually not built up. Let's go to the only one so far that I got as a gift with purchase, and that is this one here gift with purchase, set number 404. Eight, seven and it's the sailboat sailboat adventure this is a really cool set i do i do enjoy this and it was made for the lego ideas obviously and um it was a competition to uh, make your 
uh, Lego set to be a Lego Ideas gift with purchase. So that's congratulations to whoever this was. I can't remember who it was again, but some really cool elements in here, uh, golden elements and that sort of stuff. So that'll be getting built on stream as well. All right, boys, <laughs> let's get to the nitty gritty here. Okay, we're going in with this one. This is Darth Vader's Meditation Chamber. Set number, I can't see it on the front here, set number 75296, 88 plus 663 parts. This has went under the radar, I think, and this is not really appreciated as it probably should be. And this is an, a really cool, awesome reset. I love this. And I can't wait to make this on the stream as well. I would talk about the sets more, but we've got quite a few to get through. Um, so yeah, let's go on with this one here. Uh, this is personal highlight for me in terms of the minifigures we get in this one. Uh, 75316. It's the uh, Mandalorian Starfighter here, the second one uh, that we've received. I, I got the first one, so I can do a comparison video of these two, which is awesome. Um, so ages 9 plus, and we get three minifigures here. So we've got Gar Saxon, we've got Pokatan, and we've got the uh, Mandalorian Loyalist. Awesome, awesome minifigures there. Um, we're getting so much cool uh, Mandalorian um, armor, obviously in the new um, Mandalorian armor set that comes out September 1st, I think. That's the only one of the, um, of the wave that I didn't receive. Okay, so going in with this one here. Controversial name for this one, but set number 75, I repeat, uh, 75312 Boba Fett's Starship, otherwise known as uh, Slave One. But yet again, there's so much cool Mandalorian stuff here um, in terms of the armor and everything that's going on. Uh, we obviously get the older Boba Fett here um, and the Mandalorian there as well that we've received before in uh, other sets. Well, that is just so, so cool. So, so, so awesome. I don't know if this is my favorite. I can't pick from all these sets. I can't pick which is my favorite and which isn't because they're just so, so good. Excuse, I excuse the bedhead. I did go for a nap before this video. Um, wasn't feeling that well, but I'm feeling reinvigorated. This one here, this is a big boy. This is the 75314, the Bad Batch Attack Shuttle. Coming with all these guys. Probably the best minifigure selection of the lot. Even the gonk droid, man. Oh, that gonk droid. The best of the bunch there. But we get Hunter, Wrecker, Tech, Echo, and Crosshair as well. These are all awesome minifigures. I love the speeder. I love everything going on here. No complaints, really. Maybe a slight... Um, lack of information for the uh, designers in terms of the coloration for this set but ah, it's not as bad as with some sets in the past okay now we go to our penultimate one the second last one here Ugh. now this is a big big boy uh oh i'm gonna actually gonna have to go back here actually Z zoom out a little bit there zoom out a little bit there um so this is 75315 imperial light cruiser and the, the the one that I'm looking for here is obviously the Moth Gideon in terms of Dark Saber. I'm excited for him, but I'm also excited for the Dark Trooper. We, we have to get a Dark Trooper battle pack at some point uh, next year in 2022. It just has, it's, it's, it's inevitable, it has to happen. It can't just stay in this set, it just can't stay exclusive like that. Okay guys, the final set and the biggest of the lots, the most expensive of the lots. Are you guys going to be surprised? Probably not. If you didn't know, this is my favourite ship in all of Star Wars. Ugh! It's the Republic gunship, the UCS Republic gunship, 75309, 3292 parts, 18 plus. What a beast. What an absolute beast of a set this is. I can't wait, honestly. When, when I stream this, I'm probably going to do a stream for a, a day off. I, I, and I'm going to be doing streaming all day. I'm going to build all the other sets first in terms of uh, smallest to biggest. So I can get reviews out on the channel. But then I'm going to be building this boy and it's going to be so good. 
But anyways, guys, that is the haul for you today. So hopefully you've enjoyed. This has been my biggest ever Lego haul on the YouTube channel. So if you could smash the like button, I would appreciate that. And obviously uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel as well to keep updated with all my Lego new, all the Lego news, all the Lego hauls, all the Lego builds, all the Lego reviews, all the Lego live streams, all the Lego everything, guys. And obviously hit that post notification bell to keep updated exactly when I post. Anyways, guys, until next time, peace out. Have a nice rest of your day, and I'll catch you later on on the Sith Geek YouTube channel. Bye, guys. Guys, I'm gonna go to sleep. I always love doing that, like playing Iron Man when I sneeze, and I sneeze really awkward. Like, anyways, guys.